Hey guys, John here, what is up? Uh, last time we left off, I'm not sure if this is where we were, I was having some more problems with the game, it started, uh, like, kicked me out again, but I think I got it fixed again, so let's, let's hope. Um, not much has changed, well, I can't, I don't know what happened to those, there's a bunch of armies down here, but they seem to have disappeared. I may be a little bit after, or before, somewhere around there, uh, so yeah, I don't know if this is where we left off, but let's go ahead and look into this. I'm still trying to figure out a way I could take advantage of this conflict so I could take a port here. Um, just going to try to sit on the sidelines for now. I uh, Also, I just realized my army was uh, mobilized. That could be part of the problem that I was losing so much money last time, so I went ahead and demobilized them for now. Let's go ahead and open this up. Revolution, revolution is different islands, crisis, labs, revolution, Mecklenburg, okay we got rebels, so let's jump in here, let's go take them out real quick. Um, let's just zoom out real quick and take a look at the map. I don't think much has changed. Can't keep zooming. Wait. What happened here? This was Russia, but who is it now? Let me see. Finland. They won independence or something? No, there's a satellite. Huh. I don't know what happened there. Um, I don't. You don't really usually see NPC nations granting independence to a uh, satellite. So that kind of surprised me. Maybe they got like a lot of uh, points built up there, and like um, rebels. Maybe I don't know. Maybe they just decided to be worth. Uh, wouldn't be worth holding on to it, but just make it a satellite, so... I think what that means is that they're getting money from it, but it's technically an independent nation, so... Um... That could lead... Oh. That could lead to problems between Russia and Sweden. Because if you look here... Sweden has a core claim here. Uh, so Sweden could end up going to war with Finland and Russia over that's we'll have to keep an eye on that let's go ahead and zoom back down here try to take out these rebels might have to mobilize uh, the army again Did we just lose the whole army? Uh, we did. Okay. Mobilize. Okay. Um, I don't see them anymore. Okay, so we're going to need to get some more men coming in. Good old army. Let's, uh, let's grab some infantry. There we go. Okay, no, no, pull back. I don't want these guys there. Let's pull them out of the way. Uh, okay, um... Hmm. That's weird. War between Italy and Austria, prices collapse, the US expands. I take more territory, I have to look over there. Luxembourg's relations. Let's take a look over there real quick. I want to see what's going on.
Oh, okay, they take an even more land up here into Canada. Uh, let's take a look around here, see what's going on. Because it could lead to some problems right here with the on the Russian and uh, British border here. Then again, it could also lead. I've seen that happen before on another game I was playing as. Uh, was I playing as? I can't remember, but. Canada that all of a sudden became independent over here uh, because the U.S. had expanded so much. I don't know what was going on there. That might happen here, but I'm not sure. But it, then again, it could, yeah, just lead to war between the U.K. and the U.S., so. To keep an eye on that, maybe. Um, okay, the rebels are just pretty much staying there, so I'm gonna try to keep my men pulled back. Try to build them up. Austria might end up winning this, it's looking like, so. Just keep an eye on that. Try to. Use that to our advantage any way we can. So let's speed time up here a little bit more. Okay. Let's go here to more men. I'm gonna want. Some cavalry. And artillery. Let's grab one of these guys here. Okay. Let's take a look into the uh, progress there in the over here. No show wars. Yeah, the Austrians are winning. This might be about where I left off, I think. Because I remember some of these messages from the last episode. There we go. That should do it. Let's just take a look at what they got. If I can. I can select these guys. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's risk it. Not sure if I have enough there. I would prefer to have more, but I want to get these guys taken out pretty fast. We might win this. I can't believe I lost my whole army there to uh, this group of rebels. They put up more of a fight than the. Uh... Oh, what the? What is going on? Why are they running? Come back. No, no, stand and fight. Come on. Let's go back here. Well, these aren't even soldiers, really. They're farmers and laborers. I prefer one of my allies help me here. What Hurtenberg, where are you going? He just keeps marching through. I don't know why he's not helping us. Alright, we're gonna have to, um. These, uh, anarcho liberals might actually win this war. I would prefer to have just let the reactionaries from last episode win. Um, I 
Man. Okay. Lippish. Where the lippish? It must be a German. Disaster Zerk. Oh, yeah, two battles there we lost. Um. I need to take these guys out fast. They're starting to rebuild troops. I don't know why these guys won't help us. Alright, let's just see what they want. Maybe that'll, uh... Doesn't say what they want. Let's look over here. Hmm. Deep sphere of influence. Some of my sphere of influence. Where are we? Switzerland. Okay, hold on. let me pause this real quick so I can look at it. France. Protected by. Here we go. Here's us. France has a. a s huh. That's interesting. I didn't know that. Um. Well, then, in order for us to become a uh, colonial power, I'm probably going to have to get. Rid of them there, or not? You know, not take them out off the map. I mean, take their uh, claim off of us. So let's go ahead and start the thing back up there. That was interesting. Um, okay, guys, I think I want to call this an episode. Thanks for watching. I will see y'all next time.